Well, hello everyone and welcome to my channel. I'm Martin Henry back here with another video and today I'm going to unbox the ThinkPad Ultra Dark that just arrived today. The video will be split into four parts, unboxing which is happening now as I speak, front panel controls, rear connections and ports and the final part of the video making all the connections and switching on. Lenovo makes three ThinkPad docks, starting with the basic dock called the ThinkPad Basic Dock, followed by the ThinkPad Pro Dock, and then the ThinkPad Ultra Dock, which is what we are looking at today. This is the top dock with the most connections. This dock is suitable for the ThinkPad Lenovo L series from L450 up to L570. The Lenovo T series, which goes from T440 up to T570, and the Lenovo X series, which goes from the X250 to the X270. So I will leave a link for these down on the description. If you like the content and find it helpful, please subscribe and like the video and thank you. Right, ultra dark. And here we got two keys. Okay. Two bonny looking keys. And uh, He's going there. So here we've got the ThinkPad Ultra Dock, and uh, this is the front view. So we're going to go through here what all these things do and what they are. First, uh, we've got a power button, so you can turn your uh, laptop on and off using this power button. This little thing up here, we've got a key lock indicator. So when you lock the key, this shows that the uh, key is locked. Here we've got a docking station indicator. This turns on when your computer is docked. So when you push your computer down, this light here comes on to show it's docked. On here we've got an eject button. So you press that to release the computer from the docking station. Here we've got a slider adjustment. This guides your computer onto the docking station. So you put your computer there and this is just a guide to guide it on. We've got a docking station connector. This is used to attach to your computer. So this is what does all the connections. Here on the back, this is an always on, this yellow connector is an always on USB connector. So you could, uh, and it's a 2.0, and you can use it to charge with, say, your mobile phone or digital devices. And it's an always on USB connector. Here we've got two USB 2.0 connectors and on here these blue ones here are USB 3.0 connectors. We've got an Ethernet connector to connect to an Ethernet LAN and here we've got where you plug the power in so it's an AC power connector so you can connect your power adapter onto this. This port here 
is a display port connector. This, this is used to attach high powered or high performance monitors or a direct drive monitor or other device that use a display port connector. So you've got two of them. And in the middle here, then you've got a HDMI connector. That's for high definition TV or even a monitor that has HDMI compatibility. And next on here on this connector here is a DVI connector used to connect a monitor that supports digital video interface, which is what DVI stands for. It provides a digital interface only, so this connector can only be used with a monitor that supports a DVI connection. So moving on here we've got the older but still used VGA connector which is used to connect the older type VGA compatible video devices such as the VGA monitor. On here we've got an audio connector so you can connect your headphones or a headset that has a 3.5 millimeter connector and here we've got the Kensington lock so you can lock your docking station down onto your bench uh, to keep it from being uh, stolen. That's all the connections on the back and we've covered the connections on the front. Okay so here we're going to make the connections. On the blue one here I'm going to plug in, uh, this is an Arbidon connector, I'm going to plug in a uh, mobile phone. I'm going to plug the power, which is this one here, power, so that's going here. My phone is charging. HDMI here for my uh, monitor here. So we're going to plug that in here. And we're going to have an audio here, which is this cable here, into this little mixing desk. It's going to power, which is going to uh, come through my speakers. So that goes in in the 3.5 connector here. So now I've got a uh, wireless keyboard here. And it comes with this little uh, dongle. So I'm going to use a 3.0 port here. So I'll use that one. Power that up. So now I've got an external hard drive. So I'll want to use the 3.0 port for this as well. So we get some speed. I'm going to plug that in here. Okay. And This is my ThinkPad, Lenovo ThinkPad. It's an L460. So this, this is what's the connection point here. So we're going to dock this onto it. And I have also have a uh, trust wireless mouse. So I could put that in here as well, because I've got loads of, loads of USB ports there because I might want to bring the laptop with me and I might want to grab a mouse when I'm mobile. So I normally leave that in the laptop itself and anything you plug in here indeed will work as well. So now I'm going to dock the laptop onto the docking station. Then you just shove it down. 
lock it up and you see the little locking light comes on and I normally now will leave this closed and I'll be using this monitor here so it turns my uh, laptop into a desktop and it gives me bigger screen so you can switch it on then here by just pressing that button and you can see starting up so there's coming up on the screen so there we have it So you can turn the turn it on and off here using this button. When the laptop is locked in, so you could take them keys away with your now nobody can remove your laptop and if you had the Kingston lock onto the desk, then nobody can steal your equipment. So then when you come back, if you want to remove your laptop, put in your key, unlock it, and then you press the release button, and that releases it. Take it off, like that. Okay, so that release just releases those latches here. And that's it for the Lenovo Ultra Dock docking station. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe to my channel. Um, I, I do music videos, everything about music, computers and IT. Thank you.